We continue to celebrate the 50 year career uh, at WKRG of Mel Showers, who will be retiring from his 6 and 10 newscast next week. Tonight, the technological changes Mel has seen shape the industry. News 5's Peter Albrecht is here with more. Well, from typewriters and film to digital cameras and the ability to report live from almost anywhere, a lot has changed since Mel Showers became a reporter for WKRG back in 1974. This is the oldest Mel Shower story we believe exists, shot in the summer of 75 on videotape. Before that, stories were shot on 16 millimeter film. The first camera I got was a Bell and Howell crank. Crank, crank, crank. And that Bell and Howell used to provide me with video only. The station also had more advanced cameras that also captured audio. And that film that was shot had to be processed with a strict 3 o'clock deadline to be able to get it back in time for editing for the evening news that aired then at 5.30. We were hightailing up there trying to get that film in before the deadline because if you didn't, you are doomed. In 1975, WKRG went to what's called electronic news gathering, ENG, or UMATIC, three-quarter inch videotape, which unlike film, was reusable. That revolutionized how we gather news. You could go to a news conference, hit play, and let it roll. You didn't have to worry about, is he about to give me a good sound uh, comment? Three-quarter inch tape would give way in the 90s to beta, and soon after, beta SP and beta SX, before going digital about 15 years ago. Mel says another big early advancement was the live truck that allowed coverage live from remote locations. That allowed us to enter a new era where we could say we're going live now to the scene. Back then, before then, we, everything was filmed. Huge live trucks have now been largely replaced with tiny backpacks that allow reporters to go live from almost anywhere. In Mel's early days, he would often shoot and report his story, a so-called one-man band, now in vogue again thanks to technology. They do that now, but the difference is, instead of having to carry all of this bulky equipment, now you can do it with a cell phone. In fact, we had a report on just tonight where the entire report was done by the reporter on a cell phone. An advancement Mel Showers could never have imagined when he began working almost 50 years ago. Oh, there's been so many improvements over the years, and all of them for the better. And you can learn more about Mel's career at WKRG.com. And I want to show you this. This is about seven hours of content uh -huh. on our old tape replaced by right. an SD card. And Mel, look what our engineer Keith Rozelle found. How about that? Does that, no ah. Does that noise bring something back? Yes, I'll, it does. I'll leave that there with you. <laughs> Very cool. You know, no, you we've mentioned come a long way. <laughs> you have. And we talked about the Mojos now can get it with their cell phone. You had Mojo way back then. <laughs> One man band, but it was not with a cell phone. <laughs> In fact, I wish we had cell phone uh, technology back then. A little bit lighter than that camera yeah. right Yeah, there. this is pretty heavy. <laughs> that is very cool. Thank you, Pete.